What is up, YouTube? It's your boy T Dog with another video. I hope you can see this. I've been, uh, I noticed on my last videos that, uh, the camera angle on my GoPro hasn't really been the best. Uh, I also changed the, uh, aspect ratio, the field of view vision or whatever. So I might have to change that back just to see more. I don't know. But, anyways, the ZX6R out here riding it, trying to get used to it, trying to get my body, uh, you know, accustomed to this, uh, riding style i'm digging it i'm loving it i'm uh still in the honeymoon phase so i haven't really been showing the volcaness any love but uh i'll be back on that bike soon enough because as it stands now this bike is kind of just like my weekend warrior thing and the volcaness is kind of going to be like the uh the daily as uh you may want to call it but yeah in this video i want to talk about mods mods on this bike what am i gonna do well plain and simple not a lot <laughs> jake when he built this he pretty much did everything that i wanted to do to a, Z a zx6r especially one of this generation or so there's really not much i can do to this bike it has everything i want and everything i need at this point i'm just looking at maintenance the only mods that i've been thinking of lately are really just cosmetic the blue's been my favorite color since i was a kid so i love the blue but i might wrap it kind of like what i did with the vulcan s because I love the color, I love the paint job, I kind of want to protect it from the elements. So I want to wrap it, but I want to wrap it in a, a unique color that isn't common? I mean, I'm already set on a certain color. I looked up, you know, bikes wrapped in that color, and from what I could tell, no bike is wrapped in that color. So I might go for that. And I'm going to keep these gold bolts, these gold uh, fairing and windshield bolts that Jake did. You know, that wrap color with a little bit of gold accents, so I'm going to keep those gold bolts and maybe add some ac accents i might even print out or have someone print out stickers or decals like the like the factory decals but in gold a gold kawasaki here on the both sides of the tank zx6r on both sides of the tail then just a ninja 636 a gold kawasaki across here maybe probably just wrap the blue to be honest uh leave the black how it is i might do some of the black i don't know i might do like this part on both sides i don't know yet and the other mod i've been thinking about doing is retrofitting projectors in these stock headlights and i might do halos too halos uh i don't want to do like the, the changing color halos i might just i want i just want to do like a solid color and it's going to be the color to match the wrap so i might do that which is kind of funny because i actually i make fun of halos on bikes trucks cars you name it you name it i don't know it just kind of seems like a ricer thing but for the sake of aesthetics and what I'm going for with this bike, I might do that. To go with the gold accents, I might get these wheels power coated to match the same gold that I'm going for. Right now they're just the stock wheels and they're just, you know, black or gray or whatever it is. So it's, it's whatever. Two things I need to add. A cover for this, as you can see before Jake picked it up, the previous owner dropped it or something. And an engine cover for this. I already kind of eyed what I want in terms of cover. I think Woodcraft makes some good ones. So I'll probably go for those. If I have the money, I might change out this Yoshimura to uh, the black one. Just to go with the look. It's not that big of a deal. But that's low on the priority list, really, to be honest. I'll probably add some tank pads here on both sides. Just to, uh, you know, for the functionality of it. I need a steering dampener. And I need some form of phone holder probably get a big reservoir cover for this those are cheap those are whatever yep i think that may be it <laughs> to be honest like i can't think of anything else any other money i put into it would just go to maintenance really that's i guess that's one of the downsides of getting a, a bike that's already customized and all that stuff if you like customizing your stuff i mean but if you get a car or bike that's customized already like there's really not much you can do on the flip side it's stuff that i wanted to do anyway so you know in the long run i, I guess i saved money on that and that's pretty much it let's go ride i need to tighten this down this thing is uh this bolt's loose Woo, baby yeah baby One thing I should talk about is gear. I really want to get more sport bike oriented gear. 
appropriate boots, gloves, uh, you know, leather jacket, eventually leather pants. Do I need it? Nah, that's debatable, but it's one of those things where it would be nice. These riding gloves and these shoes, I mean, they're fine for the Vulcan, but on, on this bike, uh, I think I could do a little bit better, more uh, appropriate feet and hand protection and whatnot. You watch, you wait your turn, boy. I do eventually want to get like a, some kind of leather jacket, like you know, I don't know. Ooh, nice Lambo. And then uh, appropriate sport bike pants. My gear right now is is, is you know it's great. It's uh fine for the Vulcan S, but. Jesus, the thing is so easy to go fast on, God. So far, I'm enjoying this bike, loving it. And, like, I mean, I mentioned, like, I'm in the honeymoon phase, so, like, you know, all over this bike ever since I got it. But, uh, you know, I'll, I'll calm down eventually. I'll calm down on it eventually. So, yeah, those are the mods I, I could, you know, I want. And, and honestly, they, those are really the mods I can do, <laughs> as far as I can tell. If y'all have any suggestions, go ahead and put them in the comments. I don't mind. I'm open to opinions and suggestions. And also gear, if y'all have any, like, you know, suggestion on type of a sport bike gear, that'd be great too. Hopefully I'll be able to hit some routes sometime in the near future with this thing. I'm kind of dying for some. I haven't hit, I haven't hit any uh, good routes in a couple weeks now. Or a few weeks, actually. God, I'm almost out of gas already. Shit. That's what happens when you're throttle happy on these things. This thing has a bigger... This thing has a bigger gas tank than the Vulcan S, but I'm pretty sure the Vulcan S still has better gas mileage than this thing. <laughs> uh, that's all I wanted to talk about in this video. I'm gonna go get some gas for this thing. Thank y'all for watching. If you like what you saw, go ahead and like the video and subscribe for more content in the future. Go ahead and comment and share if you want to. And I'll see y'all next one. Peace. A few moments later.